Wells. Mary Kay Sales Director started my business way back in 2006. And today it is my joy to share with you a couple of my Mary Kay girlfriends. My name is Deidre Linton. I am a Mary Kay Beauty Consultant and I have the distinction of being a red jacket at the moment. When I'm not selling Mary Kay, my favorite thing to do is spend time with my grandchildren. They are the loves and joy of my life. Hi, my name is Antonietta, and when I'm not working my Mary Kay business, I work for a local government agency. In my free time, I love spending good quality time with my family and friends. Hi, my name is Christina, and I'm a Mary Kay consultant. When I'm not working my Mary Kay business, I'm a full-time mom to a senior in high school. I'm also an event decor designer with an emphasis on balloons. So basically, I set up parties and make sure that everyone has a blast. I started my Mary Kay business uh, probably almost 13 years ago. And I started because I love the product and I wanted the discount. So it wasn't until I retired um, around three years ago that I decided I wanted to be a full service Mary Kay representative. And I haven't looked back. It's now I started my Mary Kay business in September of 2021. And I started because I love the opportunities that Mary Kay offered me. I love that I could work a flexible schedule, be my own boss, um, make a 50% profit and get my favorite products at 50% off. I opened my Mary Kay business in April of 2022. I absolutely love it. I originally started as a personal use consultant uh, because I love the product and I wanted to get the product at a steep discount. Uh, shortly after, I decided to make some additional money by selling the products as well. I told you back in 2006, I opened my Mary Kay business because I absolutely loved what these products did for my skin. I was a customer for about a year and a half and I hosted about three parties during that time uh, because I love the products, but I love them for free. Can you relate to that? So I love free products. I didn't want to pay full price. And after after three parties, you know, this is way back before um, social media was really a thing. So you really were like dependent on friends and family who live near you who could come over to your house. After three parties, I ran out of local friends. Uh, so I thought, you know what, if I'm going to use these products, I might as well get them at cost. So that's my big claim to fame. I opened my business for a discount. Can you believe it? My first goal was, like I said, just for myself, my product. And then once I retired, I thought, I'm still young. I still have a lot to offer. Let's go for this. This is a company that I love. I love their values. I love my Mary Kay sisters. I love everything that the company stands for. So my first Mary Kay goal was to make a $300 profit. And I was able to do this by calling my family and friends or texting my family and friends. And I was also able to use social media. My first Mary Kay money goal was to earn $500. I really didn't know what I wanted uh, to do at that time, but I figure if I can do $500, then of course I can do $1,000. And if I can do $1,000, then I can do $1,500. So it was more of a challenge to see how much money I could make. And the first goal that I set in my mind was 500. My very first Mary Kay money goal, um, I decided to be a star when I opened my business. And that meant that I was going to have product on my shelf to serve my customers. And my first money goal was to pay for that, for, to pay that investment, right? Um, but in doing that, uh, I did what was called Power Star, which is 30 faces in 30 days. And I did that my first two months. So 60 faces in two months, more than paid for my star. In fact, we had a sweet little profit left over. So the very first thing that my Mary Kay money did, um, I remember it was a Sunday afternoon and we went to Petland. And I remember seeing the little like play area of pugs and we went to play with one of the pugs and it was like the heavens opened up and shined down on our pug uh, that we came home with and we named her Skittle and she lived with us for 15 wonderful years so that was my very first Mary Kay goal what my Mary Kay money paid for when I first started the one thing that probably held me back from being more than just a user myself was I lived in Florida and I really didn't have that many friends. But with social media these days, you don't need that. You, I have met so many fabulous ladies and new friends on Facebook and other media. So that is not an excuse for me. Um, if anything would have held me back from getting started, it would have been that I wasn't really comfortable with wearing makeup or even knowing how to apply it. But I'm so grateful that Mary Kay has trainings for us to teach us about skincare and makeup. And I love that my director and my sister consultants are just a phone call away. 
if anything would have held me back um, from starting Mary Kay, I think it would have been like self-doubt. Um, the personal belief that I could be successful with a Mary Kay business. Um, sometimes we all have that self-doubt and you know it's not always easy to overcome that, um, but I didn't let that stop me. Uh, Mary Kay has a guarantee where after a year of doing the business, if you're not satisfied um, with your business itself, the company will do a buyback of your product for a certain percentage. Uh, so it's, it was almost kind of foolproof uh, for me, you know, uh, almost a no-brainer uh, where I would get my discount on the product that I know that I love, uh, along with the option of doing a buyback if for some reason it wasn't ex what I expected. If anything would have held me back from getting started in my business, it would have been, um, I love, love, love my friends and family. And like I told you, I had uh, quite a few, we had three parties, but when it came time for me to have my kickoff party, um, I guess I tapped the pipeline because nobody showed up to my kickoff party. I thought they would all come over and everyone was gonna go home with the skincare set. The reality is I had one family members show up. She bought a microdermabrasion. So grateful. What a grateful heart I had. Um, but if I would have let that influence, the lack of family support, influence my Mary Kay decision, oh my goodness, we would have missed out on so much that we've gained from this business. In addition to driving free for all these years, 10 free cars every two years. Can you get excited about that? Um, but my business had pays for the niceties. My husband has a great job, pays for the necessities, but my business has always paid for the niceties. So things like family vacations, private school for kids, um, braces on the, all their sweet faces, all the extras, the field trip mom. I wanted to be the fun mom, right? Um, and most recently we paid for my daughter's wedding. So I'm so grateful to have this as an income opportunity that I can work when I want, how I want, and contribute to my household income needs. Uh, right now, what I am most excited about is the $10 to join Mary Kay this month. I would love to build my team of five to 25. Why not go big? And for 10 bucks, well, you can't even get a meal at Chick-fil-A for $10. Now, I'm most excited about all the opportunities that Mary Kay offers. If I put in the work, then my opportunities are endless. Right now, I am most excited to see my business grow. Um, I love the products. I love the sisterhood that the Mary Kay company brings, but I'm ready to see the growth in my business um, that I've never seen before. Um, we have a great special this month for recruiting a new team members, and uh, it's amazing, so it's super exciting. Well, I think what I'm excited about is um, the incentives that this company gives us, and specifically for the month of March, I am super pumped because Mary Kay has put our business on sale, and I know that Mary Kay in corporately is just such an incredible company, when you get to know the heart of this company, you know that they have such a grasp on one thing that often stands between a woman and living the life that she dreams of is often the cost of getting started. So being able to bridge that gap with a $10 startup option, what a blessing. So yeah, right now you can get a Mary Kay e-start for 10 bucks. Uh, I don't see any reason why you wouldn't want to do that. And you get to decide if it's for you. Great. Stay. We would love to work with you. I get to work with you. Um, if you don't love it, it's okay. You don't have to stay forever. You can be part of our cheering section, encouraging the workers who are working on big goals, or you can go back to being a happy customer. That's okay too. So, but for 10 bucks, I say, give it a shot. You don't know. I've never since 2006 seen this kind of offer from Mary Kay. So I'm so proud. And Mary Kay is the number one direct sales brand of skincare and cosmetics worldwide. So you have an incredible opportunity with an incredible company who has top shelf products. I love that. I'm excited about that right now. later. My favorite product of Mary Kay, um, that was easy. It is the entire TimeWise Repair Set. I begin my day and I end my day with these TimeWise Repair products. So they are my absolute favorite. I think they have really done what they said they're supposed to do, anti-aging. I mean, yes, I'm continuing to age, but I am slowing down that process with this fabulous skincare. And my favorite Mary Kay product is a two-in-one body wash and shape gel. I love that it's a multi-purpose product. I love that it has a very light scent. It's not overpowering, so I can still wear a perfume if I want. Um, I love that it does not break my legs out when I shave because I have very sensitive legs. So I have to be careful with what I shave with. And so this is a staple in my shower. My favorite Mary Kay product is the foundation primer. It's silky smooth when I put it on my face and it kind of evens out my face texture. Uh, so it allows my foundation to go on very smoothly. So that's my favorite product. What is my favorite Mary Kay product and why? That is a hard one. I love everything Mary Kay, all things Mary Kay, head to toe. If I had to pick one product, you know, it's got to be the TimeWise Repair Set. I can't just pick one, but I love getting out of the shower. And the first thing I do is put that Volufirm Lifting Serum on to smooth that neck, the jowls, all those things that just bug us, right? I love slathering on the eye cream and then at night putting on the night cream with retinol. Mm, I just love that. So that would be my favorite, the set, the TimeWise Repair Set. 
hand. Um, my next goal, like I said, is to have 25 team members. So now my next Mary Kay goal is to build a team of 10 consultants by the end of June. And this will take me one step closer to being a Mary Kay director. My next Mary Kay goal is to obtain a gold medal, which is five new qualifying team members in one month. What is my next Mary Kay goal? Oh, and by when? Well, my friend, it's got to be the Cadillac, right? I share with you that we have driven free for the last, uh, I don't know, since 2006. I earned my first car on New Year's Eve of 2006. Since then, we have been driving free and we've had 10 physical cars that we've earned. Some of the cars we took the cash option for, uh, but it is high time for us to rise up and be a Cadillac unit. So I'm excited to be a Cadillac driver by June 30th. And what I love about that is I know every single time one of our Wells Wonder Women has a party, it always gets asked, do you have a pink Cadillac? And I want for our Wells Wonder Women to be able to say, yes, we are in a Cadillac unit. And of course, with that comes all the accolades at Seminar, which is our annual leadership event for all of our beauty consultants and sales directors. Um, and locally, like when you see a pink Cadillac driving down the road, that elevates your community. It brings, you know, you're bringing income and cash flow into your community. So I want that for my town. I live in Oviedo and I want to elevate Oviedo. It's time. What do you think? Well, thank you for taking a few minutes with me today to get to know some of my Mary Kay girlfriends, and they are just the tip of the iceberg. They are like amazing women, and then we have a whole tribe of amazing Wells Wonder Women. We actually have a unit training group. It's called Wells Wonder Women, where we offer support, recognition, training, like you name it. We have a Mary Kay buffet, and sometimes when people go to a buffet, I don't know, you tell me in the comments. When you go to a buffet, do you take a little bit of everything, or do you just stick with the thing you like, and you like pile it on your plate? Well, in Mary Kay, you get to do that. We have a Mary Kay buffet, so whatever you're, you choose like is totally up to you. We will share with you the buffet and say, this is what is all available to you. What you choose to take advantage of is totally up to you. Um, but I would love to hear from you. Like, which story did you love the most? Um, what questions do you have? And if the $10 ACE start is not for you, like, who do you know? Who do you know who could use a Mary Kay business opportunity in their life? And let's not wait. We don't need to wait until midnight on March 31st to get you started. We want to get you started right now because you might know somebody who also needs an opportunity like Mary Kay. You might be at home praying for something new, or you might have a neighbor or a cousin or a sister or best friend who's at home praying for a business opportunity like Mary Kay. The sooner you get started, the sooner we can share it with them. So 